Hi, welcome to Linux Zone. In this video I will show how to install i3 status rust and configure it. So let's begin. So run this command to install i3 status rust. Now we have to copy config file, so navigate to directory as shown. Copy the config.toml and paste in config i3 status rust directory. If you open the config file, it will look like this. Now add i3 status rust to i3 config file. Like this, status command i3 status rs. For more help, check out github page, link is in description. Now, install awesome fonts, run this command. and run fcc list command as shown on screen. It will give exact name of font to be used by i3 status rust. So add font name to i3 config file, as shown on screen, and you can change the font size, I added value 15. Now open web browser and search i3 status rust, you will see GitHub link, click it. Now click code and copy it and open terminal and paste it like this, to get clone command. Now enter the clone directory, and open install Dutch file in text editor. You will see these two commands. So make directory called i3 status rust, in dot local, share. And copy the files directory to it. Or you can run these command manually. Now to apply themes, open i3 rust status config file. So write name of theme, and icon theme which is available in themes, and icons directory, downloaded earlier, like this and reload i3 window manager. Now reload i3 window manager to see effect. Press alt plus control plus c, and alt plus control plus r. Now I am showing my configuration of different information on i3 status. First one is disk space like used, total, available free. Next is memory, such as used, total, used percentage. Next is CPU, then sound, date and time. Put percent %y to show year. Last one is network download and upload speed. The information will be shown in kilobytes per second. Next thing you should do, navigate to GitHub page, and download material icon font. And put it in, dot local share fonts. So that's it for this video, like the video and subscribe to the channel. See you in next video.